Eat your broccoli, kids. Greetings, beard lovers. I hope you're doing okay. If not, turn that frown upside down. Here's how. Frown. Hooray! Oops, I'm smiling, which now looks like a frown. Wait. Yay! Wait, wait, I'm so confused. Yay! Wait. Uh, second thought, probably not the best way to go about changing your emotions. Plus, my head detached from my body. I should be dead. Am I dead? I should ask an expert. Hey, death clone, am I dead? Oh, right, 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 right. He dead. Hey, deaf clone, am I dead? He didn't answer. <gasps> I'm a ghost. Oh wait, he's deaf, he can't hear me. I meant to ask deaf leopard clone. Hey, deaf leopard clone, am I dead? Yeah! Woo! Well, I feel alive, but he didn't answer my question. If anything, I just have more questions. Like why does deaf leopard clone hang out in the bathroom? And why could I hear his guitar when it wasn't plugged in? And why is deaf clone repeatedly rubbing the couch with a dry towel? And how long before deaf clone starts to smell? And how do I manage to keep getting food on my face when I'm eating something even as simple as broccoli? So many emotions. We should figure out how to get rid of emotions altogether. They only get us into trouble. Remember that rap feud in the 90s between Nefarious Big and Tupac Shakur? Shakur? Shakour? Tupac Shakur. Tupac, Shakur, she don't care. Any whoozle, the feud was brutal and people got angry and people got dead. The lesson is simple. Don't get angry, don't get dead. And anger isn't the only emotion that gets us into trouble. I've done some pretty dumb stuff when I was afraid, like drinking. Jealous, like drinking. Sad, like drinking. And thirsty, like drinking. Alcohol, which made me more thirsty, which made me feel dumb, which made me embarrassed, which made me drink, which made me thirsty, which made me feel So maybe society should just be a bunch of emotionless robots. Speaking of emotions and robots and feuds, there's a pretty insane feud going on right now between Mark Zuckerberg. Mark Zuckerberg. Mark Zuckerberg. Zuckerberg and Elon Musk. Elon Musk. Elon Musk. I like Musk better. In which they are arguing over whether or not AI will destroy humanity. I found AI to be at worst overrated. I don't really see what the big deal is. But Haley Joe Osment did grow up to grow a kick-ass beard, and that makes me jealous, which makes me want to drink, which made me thirsty, which made me feel dumb, which made me... But now that I think about it with actual thoughts, that's probably not the AI they're talking about. They're probably talking about real-world artificial intelligence, robots and stuff. And talk at each other they did. <laughs> it was quite a feud, you guys. It was just like Family Feud, except they weren't a family and it wasn't a game show. And Steve Harvey wasn't making fun of people every 10 seconds. So, here's how it went down, you guys. Tony Stark's second cousin and frontman for the band Tesla, Elon Musk, kept sounding the alarm bells at the National Governors Association. I know this because he said, I keep sounding the alarm bells. He also went on to say, but until people see robots going down the streets killing people, they don't know how to react. I, mean, I think I know how I'd react. Something like this. <clears throat> oh my god, robots! But human Kendall and president of Friendster Mark Zuckerberg had something else to say about it. He called Musk a naysayer. Oh, no, he did! Boom! And he didn't stop there. In some ways, I actually think it is pretty irresponsible. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. Do you think Moosk was gonna take that sitting down? I've talked to Mark about this. His understanding of the subject is limited. This is just getting too messy. Just like emotions. Thank you. Oh, now I'm getting emotional. Oh. Thank you for that delightful wink. If you would like to submit a wink, make a video of you doing the musical outro in some way, and winking, and upload the video to YouTube, title it Wheezy Wink. Don't forget if you hated this video to click thumbs down. If you are angry about something, feel free to unjustly direct your anger towards me in the comments. Thanks for watching. I didn't have to wink, someone already did.